Hey guys, Eric from Locker Lunatics. We got a weird one today. I bought two units of the facility and they told me absolutely no filming, which is the first for me. So the reason we're inside the unit and I didn't reveal opening the door for you is for that very reason. We're gonna scope around here a little bit. I'm gonna show you some reasons why I bought this little unit. We've got uh, right over here, a nice little treasure chest. We've got another little treasure chest. We've got a jewelry box type treasure chest. Back here in the back, I can see this some kind of little treasure chest. And whatever this big ass bad boy is, which is way bigger than it looked in the pictures. Um, and also I've seen a lot of VHS like the V series. That means there could be some uh, sci-fi stuff in here. So, but anyway, this one's a weird one. So we're gonna go ahead and just load this up. We'll take it home and we'll go through it there. So uh, we'll see you back at the Looney Bin. All right guys, we're back at the Looney Bin. Uh, once again, that facility would not let us film, so we had to bring everything here. We're going to go through it here at the house. As you can see, we've got uh, Tentapalooza going on. We keep trying to have a yard sale. Looks like a homeless camp right now, but uh, all of this stuff's going to be in a yard sale, hopefully by a weekend. This unit, the one that had the little treasure chests, it looks like it's going to be a whole lot of junk. Sometimes you get what you pay for. Now, what did look like a small chest in the back ended up being a gigantic filing cabinet that weighs about 10,000 pounds. That was a fun one to put on. Uh, but other than that, let's see what we got here. Now, this unit did seem to house a whole lot of DVDs and VHS. On a, on a good note, it is, there's a lot of good movies in there. Uh, a lot of uh, sci-fi, stuff like that. We got, you know, E.T. So it is stuff that will at least sell. But there's got to be a, easily over 100 movies in VHS and probably another 100 in DVD. We got a sleigh bed frame. And I do believe, like this one, I do believe it's all the same thing. It's all VHS. All the way down, lots of Disney movies. So, you know, lots of good stuff that'll sell at least. All sellable. So there is money in there. I shouldn't complain too much. Uh, I'm going to bring this box over here. We'll go through it. Right here on this little desk. Hey, these look pretty decent. There's shade over there if you want to sit down. <laughs> Sorry, we have company. There you go, that's pretty cool. We got some masks. Another one for that. Creepy ass old doll. Creepy grandma. She looks like she's one of those to sit on the edge. She's got a hole in her head. Grandma's been dropped. Oh no. I check it out. Still has a tag, $16.95, whenever they bought it. Lots of masks in here. I guess they have, looks like they might have had a Day of the Dead party or something. Oh, these are all new. Yeah, all these masks are new. Oh, clear, it's five bucks. Originally $30, though. There you go. Now, I don't know how many of these will actually make it to go to sell. My girls will probably cabbage on to quite a few of these. Well, that one's glass. Right, glass little tiger. Couple of those. There's a lot of these masks in here. All right, well, this box might have just paid for the unit. I was worried. That was a $120 unit. That seemed to be a whole lot of junk. But these are all pretty cool. I would say this box will pay for the unit very easily. Oh, we got more glass ones. That one's broken on the edge. No ear. More masks, lots of masks. That's an okay unit. Oh, here we go. We got a Aunt Jemima looking stuffed doll. Glass rose. All right, one decent box so far, looks like. Oh, what do we got here? These look like candles, of course. Uh, so we got some more black style folk art dolls. Now I have a gentleman here in town that buys this kind of stuff. Grandma, you need to see a doctor. And just four masks. The last one. More little voodoo dolls. Oh, check it out. There's the ear. Ear! these little trinket boxes 
hoping they're full of treasure. They're full of the broken pieces that go on the trinket boxes. So that's not that great. No treasure there. Got a car seat, hide a man, uh, some wall art. Lots and lots of wall art. It all matches, at least. Uh, got these two pieces. Why? That's my question. Here, seems to be books. Hey, true you, Tim Jackson. Uh, some mixed in DVDs, 50 Shades of Grey. Thank you. Glamorous life of storage. Treasure hunting. Got some more VHS. A Goodwill plate, hanging plate. Try to not break that. And then a whole bunch of, looks like, dress hats. Now look at that. A shrew. I don't know. We'll just wear that and keep the sun off. Let's see, this looks like the whole thing. How? All right, big old hat. More hats. I have to check these out. Some of these hats I know can be money. It looks like they were all like Sunday dress hats. That's a, I don't know what kind of. It's a piece of material that wanted to be a hat, but never really made it. All right, what we got in this? Come on, something good. Nope. Boots. Boots. Another hat. A buttload of CDs, looks like. Maybe any movies in there. That looks like mostly CDs. And a couple tools. Hey, Dragon Ball Z. There you go, that's a good tape. Oh, this box looks to be... We've got a Nintendo. There we go, Nintendo 64. That's good. Cables. This is like a hodgepodge. This is what most everything looked like in that unit. It's a mess. You've got remotes and kitchen stuff. Knives, watermelon slicers. If there was a pair of these, it'd be nice, but there's not. It is an old Yamaha speaker. We got uh, more artwork. More artwork. A gigantic mirror. I'm not going to give you a big body on that one. It'll blind because of the sun. What do we got here? We got a really cool car missing a door. There we go. This is the here's the box that houses all the jewelry. Or a candle. I knew it was one or the other. All candles, guys. All candles. Alright, let's check this one. Hey, alright. Better than VHS. DVDs question always asked are they in there let's grab some randoms we appear to be a winner all right like once again it was a 120 dollar unit there's probably a good 100 at least 100 dvds in here to buck a piece that's most of the money back right there good quality there oh geez yeah, just a gross mess we've got play a random dvd little miscellaneous jars yeah, this is like, a, this is all glassware. Glassware, good working clock. Yeah, kitchenware, just a little bit. Ooh, very sticky wall hangings. You can tell those were in the kitchen. Oh, a keyboard. Missing letters, okay. Or artwork. That one's kind of cool, but I don't know. No signatures on it. Almost looks hand done. Let's see, artwork. Artwork. Art, the art, the art. Stuck together art. Oh, personal picture inside. All artwork. We got a couple little chairs. A little cell in the garage cell. Little old ladies like those. And if you're a little old lady and you're offended, sorry, don't buy them. Here we got brand new pair of shoes. None. Can't really say 
Nun bush. <laughs> Nun bush. That answers the question, guys. Nuns do have a bush. Oh, these are uh, glass little hats. The lady liked her hats. Another fuzzy blanket. We got a coffee pot down here. Another pretty cool picture. Now these are the things that, this is what I bought the unit for. It was these little chests that were laying everywhere. And you can see, it's a chest, it's a chest. And they had just nothing. One of them had some photos in it. I did open it up at the unit and we took those and, and you know, give them back the photos and stuff. And see, this is the one that I thought was definitely a jewelry box. It is, but there is not one piece of jewelry in it. That's kind of like a little matching set. Oh, this one's heavy. Oh boy. Okay, we've got, looks like some pennies. Pennies and utensils. Some broken glass, scissors, the broken lock. Some fishing wire, probably the most valuable thing in this. A couple little miscellaneous cheap screwdrivers. So, all right, not the jewelry we're looking for. So we got a basket with some Christmas stuff. There's this paperwork, that's just paperwork. We'll have to go through that, give back any photos or anything important we find. Oh, we got purses. We got the purses, but do we got the money? Oh, there's stuff in here. Oh, 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 it's like a ripped up dollar. That's a part of a dollar. But look, it's in there. A little bit of tape, man. I made a dollar. Here's your dollar. Boy, talk about having to work for a dollar. Got to put the damn thing back together. Hey, there's a Spencer's gift card. Let's check that one out. Maybe some money on that. Uh, the rest of that looks personal. Well, okay, I'll put that there aside. Let's hope all, hey, if each one has a dollar in it. That was a dollar they didn't even want to spend. Too much work. Looks like a little bit of personal. Yep, nothing in that one. Nothing in there. What do we got in here? What is this? What's this? What is this? Darts. Stuff for a darts. Okay. Can't see a dart board anywhere. Hey, there's a phone. We got crap lights. These purses or totes? Uh, I think those are for iPads. Let's go, hey, maybe it's an iPad. Let's hope for the best. More, more VHS, power cords. There's a computer cord. I think we have a computer. I don't think so. It looks like all VHS and DVDs from this point on. It is filled with VHS, VHS and DVD, and VHS. They like their VHS tapes. Well, you know what? Those are making a comeback, and a lot of people do. Some, I mean, some tapes, man, if you can find some unopened ones, there's a nice little mirror. You can find a VHS tape that's unopened from the 80s. It's worth a lot of money now. What we got in here? This looks like uh, more glasses. Yep. Yeah, that's going to be all glasses. All dishes and glasses. We're just about done with this one. We got a bag of what appears to be clothes. Yep, that'll be clothes. This is all... I think this is curtains. This is all curtains. And let's see, is that it? That's about it for that unit. Now, once again, that was a $120 unit. So not too bad, not great, no treasure, but hey, it'll make some money. So here in just a minute, we'll step onto the other unit.